up you guys welcome back to my channel if you are new by here i would like to introduce myself my name is sheree i'm a single mother of four children i work full time and i also go to school full time to receive my ged your girl is walking across this stage may the 12th i cannot wait and i want you guys to come on this journey along with me so would you please subscribe to my channel like this video and also hit that post notification bell so you know every time i do post videos and i forgot to say i also do youtube part-time one day in the future i would love to do youtube full-time but until then my main focus is to get an education so i can provide more for my children Speaking of my GED, on the 30th of this month, I get to go test in my language writing. I pray to God that I pass. You guys, please send prayers up for me as well. I am kind of struggling on writing my essay, but like I said, I'm putting everything in God's hands. And I feel like I will pass it. You know, that's just one step closer to me receiving my GED, y'all. Y'all just don't understand how excited I am to walk across this stage, you know. I know I'm 31 years old. I'll be 32 by the time I receive my GED. But just know, it don't matter how old you are. Um, as long as you are picking yourself up to at least try to do better in your life. And that's the case for me. I am picking up from where I left off and doing what I've always wanted to do. I know I've quit plenty of times in my life, but this time I have been consistent with going to class, with studying, and doing good on my practice test. My practice tests is, are telling me that it's time for me to go take my test. So that's, just, so that's what I'm doing on the 30th of this month. I'm going to go sit down and test out for language. So you guys, please send those prayers up for me. Also, please do not forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video, hit that post notification bell, and also leave them comments down below. As you can see, I do not have any curtains up. I did have curtains up with the last furniture I had, but I got rid of everything in my living room. I'm actually trying to find the perfect curtains for my living room. If you guys have any suggestions, please leave the comments down below. Um, I'm really looking for something like gray, black, white, 
you know, in that nature. I don't know. I'm I'm thinking of an accent color to put in here. I don't know. I just don't want to have um, plain colors. I want a color to pop. So if you guys have any suggestions on what color would look, you know, look right, please leave them comments down below. Um, and let's talk about this sectional. I love my sectional. I've always wanted a gray sectional. I finally got me a gray sectional, you guys. Finally. And when I ordered this rug off Amazon, I swear I thought this rug was bigger than what it is. But it actually looks, it actually fits perfect. Like how it is, it actually fits perfect. I love it now. But I did actually have a little attitude when it first came in. I was like, dang, I thought it was going to be bigger than this, you know. But that's fine because my, my couch take up most of my living room. As you guys can see, my living room is not that big. Um, I don't have a lot of stuff in here. But the amount of stuff that I do have in my living room, it makes it look perfect, the size of my living room. But like I said, if you guys have any suggestions on what type of curtains I should hang up, please leave them comments down below.
this comes to the end of the cleaning video if you guys love what you saw would you please subscribe to my channel like this video leave those comments down below and also please don't forget to hit that post notification bell i would love for you guys to grow on this channel and be on this journey with me have a blessed day